looking for a holiday getaway. Maybe it's time to start planning what you're going to do for Thanksgiving, Christmas, etc. Maybe you just need a week in the woods. Well, I have Josh Coddington with me from the Arizona Office of Tourism. He found some great options in both northern and southern Arizona. Hello, how are you? Great, how are you doing? Good. So uh, it's a little warm still. Right. In, in early November. So uh -huh. where should we go first, uh, Greer? So yeah, I mean, Greer is such a great place. People love it. And, uh, you know, it's in the White Mountains. It's going to be a little cooler there. And one of the really cool places there is the Greer Lodge Resort and Cabins. It's iconic. I, I mean, mean, it's, it's famous. It's iconic. Yeah. It's beautiful. And there's some really cool things about it, though, in that they have cabins that you can choose of different sizes, but you can pick whether you want to be near the West Fork of the Little Colorado River in mm -hmm. your cabin or if you want to uh, be near their fishing pond also, oh. right? So you get to choose kind of, you know, what water you want to be by. Uh, and, and in addition, it's just a great starting point if you want to go do a hike or uh, something fun like that. I mean, just, and of course, a beautiful, beautiful part of the state. So, yeah. uh, and they go everything from, you can see the leaves changing there. Uh, they get snow in the wintertime. So really, whatever kind of cabin experience you want, you can definitely yeah. do that. In you have great options there. <laughs> yes. The Crescent Moon Ranch House is unique because of the way it's managed. So yes, yeah, so the Crescent, um, Crescent Moon Ranch House is near Sedona. It has a spectacular view of Cathedral Rock oh. uh, in Sedona. So in a beautiful part of the state, but also it's part of the U.S. Forest Service's Room with a View Cabin Program. Yeah, and so people don't know about that, but what that is is it's 19 different cabins that say were built by somebody who was a settler before that place was a national park. Wow. And now the park service manages it and you can go rent it and stay there. And so, and, and there's there's a bunch across the states, not just this one, mm -hmm. this one's a really cool one. Yeah. Uh, and the cool thing about it is the price doesn't change, it's the same all year. So Crescent Moon's like $200 a night, but most of them are in the 100 to $150 range. And you just, just get it right on the website. Mm -hmm. You can go check out, I mean, we're talking Northern, Central, East, Eastern and Southern Arizona. Wow. Okay, Katie's Cozy Cabins. I mean, I love the name. I love alliteration. Where is this one? So this is our surprise unexpected oh. one because this one is in to in Tombstone. Oh, in I love Southern Tombstone. Arizona. I think I've seen these. Yes. Okay, tell so, me more. So if you want a cabin that's not in the mountains, yeah. then you can go in this one. These cabins are right off of Allen Street, which is the famous street in mm -hmm. Tombstone where all the cool famous places are. OK Corral, uh, the Birdcage Theater, yeah. all those places. And these cabins are literally right off of there. And so, and you know, they still have uh, air conditioning if you need it, or uh, ceiling fans, kitchenettes, mm -hmm. everything you can need. It's an A frame cabin, uh, but it's just kind of a different way to have a cabin stay and check out some of our Wild West history. Yeah. Tombstone is fun. I mean, it's fun anyway, right? Like, you should <laughs> yeah. totally go to Tombstone. Yeah. Uh, and, and just, I mean, just such a, a beautiful part of the state uh -huh. and a different vibe than uh, the mountain cabin. It's a desert cabin, but still really fun. Yeah, no doubt. Josh, great to see you twice in one week. I know. It doesn't feel like years ago we were at the World Series. <laughs> I mean, it does feel like <laughs> does a long time like ago, that. but, you know, yeah. we got we to gotta give a shout-out to the Diamondbacks yeah, and say, so great for bringing all of that here to Arizona. Yeah, no doubt. Great to see you. Yeah, great to see you, too.